Oh, good evening, listeners. We're here in Essen uh, with Tormentor from Disaster. Good evening. Hello. Nice to see you. Nice to see you too. Um, the most listeners uh, from our radio station uh, know Disaster already, but uh, can you uh, tell a bit more uh, of, of the band to, to the listeners? Yeah, we started in uh, our guitar player started in '89 uh, with the band, and after some lineup changes uh, in 2001, we have this lineup what's right now, and yeah, we recorded seven studio albums and a lot of seven inches and blah blah i don't know and play a lot of shows and uh, yeah we're still around and try to keep metal metal <laughs> to keep metal metal oh, yes, yes. Uh, what are the uh, men's uh, main influence or inspiration uh, i think uh, of course you know if you are playing kind of thrash metal you must be slayer in it and it must be some i don't know creator and sodom and stuff but uh, i think at the moment um, our influences are from everywhere every band we listen to we try to get the best parts of it in the music so but at the end everything ends in noise <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Yeah, so in uh, February the album uh, The Arts of Destruction came out. How did the fans and the media react? Ah, it was uh, was a nice feeling because uh, you know the uh, the previous album was um, was also a very good one, but this time we tried something special with the sound. We g we had a new sound engineer and stuff, so and um, yeah, and uh, it works fine, you know, and um, also the songs was a bit more. Uh, With uh, was more powerful and stuff. So, yeah, and I think the people like that. I also know that we um, uh, sold already 3,000 copies of CDs or something. So I think it's for that kind of band and music we have is not that bad. So yeah, it's nice. It's great that uh, people still buying CDs and records. You know, so it's cool. Yeah. Well, another question is, uh, what can we expect in the future from Disaster? That's a good question. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't know. You know, it's um, we are not that band who's planning for years. You know, we just say we are doing our stuff now, and then we try to play the next year some shows, and that's all. You know, if there is uh, new songs uh, which are good enough to to ban on an album, we do that. If not, we have to wait for. So, I think we do some maybe some split stuff next time. There's uh, two things in uh, progress now but i don't know if it's happened or not so i don't say some uh, too much about that yeah and um, yeah we'll see in uh, two years we have our 25th anniversary and then we do some uh, special show and a dvd and stuff so that's the main point we're working on now okay that's uh, really cool uh, another question is uh, are there any plans uh, to come to the netherlands again no we'll never play in netherlands again <laughs> <laughs> no, why not? No, 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 just kidding. No. <laughs> That's not bad. That's not bad. <laughs> not bad. We like to be in Germany. <laughs> okay, no, no. I think uh, we love playing in 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 the uh, Netherlands. But um, the thing was, in years ago, we played too much, you know. So people fed up a little bit, and now we try to keep it calm. And um, we have uh, our friend Roman fr from TMR, TMR, yeah, TMR. Um, he is uh, he's doing the shows in the Netherlands for us and when there is a, a slot for us we play of course you know but it's not uh, yeah last year we played at, uh, Eind, uh, at Eindhoven metal meeting for example yeah that yes. was last year and yeah uh, and the cool fest yeah but that's many years ago that was 2005 or something yeah, yeah with yeah. holy moses uh, okay. and uh, yeah, yeah and pulverizer played the last time that's one of my favorite uh, um, bands from um, Netherlands by the way next to uh, asfix of course okay um, We uh, go uh, very often to Germany for metal concerts and we really like the atmosphere in, at the concerts. Uh, what is your opinion about the German metal scene? <laughs> it's a, a strange it's a strange question because um, you know of course it's great to uh, play in Germany and to go to festivals and go to uh, gigs and stuff. But for example, uh, as a band, I prefer to play more in, uh, in you know, South America and stuff because people there are really hot. You know, they stay in, they're biting in the in the in, in the stage. You know, because they want to. Uh, you know. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, but I think um, Germany and also I think Benelux as well. They have a very good um, scene at the moment, which is really good uh, um, with a lot of bands. Especially the death metal scene is coming uh, out again. So I think yeah, we can be proud of that. That's cool. Yeah. Well, um, yeah. Well, this is. <laughs> thanks for the interview. This, uh, we're coming to the last question. Is, uh, do you have anything to say to uh, our listeners? 
Um, what should I say? <laughs> well, something you want to share with the fans or something? Uh, uh, um, yeah, uh, first, thank you for the interview very much. It was great. And uh, yeah, I don't know, maybe uh, check out our new album. And if you don't like it, don't buy it. <laughs> <laughs> they have to like it. <laughs> yeah, I already have it. It's uh, really awesome. So, uh, okay. yeah, well, thanks a lot and uh, have a great show. Thank you well. Okay. Thank you. Okay. <laughs>